Hey Premiere Pros, it's Paul Murphy here, and today I'm going to show you how to quickly update a motion graphics template created in After Effects after you've added it to your Premiere Pro timeline. So I have a motion graphics template that I've created in After Effects here in my library. I'm just going to drag this into my timeline and I'm going to create a few copies of it. And now what I want to do is customize each one a little bit. So I'm going to change the text and I'll also change the color. So now that I've done that, the question is, how do I change the font or any other element in my template so that it will update across all of these clips? Not only that, but how do I do it without losing all of these custom settings that I've just added? Well, first we need to go back to After Effects and make these changes. So I'm just going to switch over to my After Effects project and make sure I have the comp loaded that I used to create my motion graphics template. First thing I'll do is change the text. I'll just change it to something else that's noticeable. And then I'll go over to my libraries, which is where I saved my previous template. And I'm just going to delete that. And then I'll go over to my essential graphics panel, make sure I have that comp loaded here. And then I'm going to export that out again to that same library. Now the problem is that these clips in my timeline are no longer linked to the template that I used to create them. So they won't automatically update. But there is a quick way to replace all of them with this new template that I've just created. So I'm going to go over to my essential graphics panel and go over to the browse tab. There's that template that I've just created. And what I want to do is hold down the option key or alt on PC. If you've watched my video on hidden shortcuts in Premiere, you'll know it's one of my favorite keys. And I'm going to click and drag this onto any of the clips that I want to replace. When I do, I get this dialog box here that says, do you want to replace this template everywhere it's used in your project? I'll click yes. And now you can see it has updated my clips, but it's also kept all of their custom settings. And I actually added this motion graphic to another sequence in my project, and you can see it has updated them as well. So it's updated everything in my project file. Now, an important thing to keep in mind is you can replace your graphics with any template this way, but Premiere will only hold on to your custom settings if the new template was created using the same After Effects composition as the old one. So if I switch back to After Effects, that means any new motion graphics template that I make should be made using this comp here. If I was to duplicate this comp and load this over in my essential graphics, I'm just going to export this as it is to the same library. I'll switch over to Premiere, go to my essential graphics panel to browse, and there's that new template that we've just created. I'll hold down option and drag this onto any clip in my timeline, and I'll click yes. And you can see that it's reset all of those custom settings in my motion graphics now. So even though that comp looks exactly the same as the original one and has the same properties, it will not hold on to those custom settings. So that's why it's really important to do it with the original comp. And that's how you replace a motion graphics template while holding onto your custom settings. I hope you found this video useful. And if you did, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.